Good morning, world. It is Mystic Intellect, and I am here with a video, honey. If you are new to this channel, welcome. But if you are watching this video, then this message is definitely for you, okay? This message is definitely for you. Now, so... Before we go into this reading, I want to just thank you all for the support, for the love, and for all the bookings that I have for the month of February. Um, this is my first video for the month of February due to the surge in readings and bookings that I had. I am so, so grateful. And thanks to my money oil, I will have to give it, give it up to this product here because it did help me a lot in terms of... Um, receiving all the bookings I needed, receiving all the financial blessings that I needed. And I wanted to go ahead and share this product with you. It's called Money Oil by, of course, yours truly, Mystic Intellect. So it will be on sale on the website very, very soon. And if you would like to subscribe to my um, email listing, go ahead and fill out the referral form on my website, www.mysticintellect.com. So you can send that link over to anybody who need, who is in need of my services or you feel could use my services. And I will be able to collect the information from that form and add you to uh, my email list for whatever announcements or freebies or goodies that I have um, for you. All right. So let's go ahead and get started. Oops. You didn't see that. You didn't see that. Okay, let's go ahead and get started on this reading. Or what message does your person have for you? All right. So before we tap into how your person feels, what message they have for you, think of a person that you have been thinking about. Well, if there's a person that comes to mind, then that is the person that we are addressing today. They have a message for you, but before we dive deep into this reading, I want to go ahead and tap into your mind, body, and soul to see what's going on with you, all right? To see what's going on with you, first and foremost, truly, because you matter. You know, you matter. And so, and then we're going to tap into them and where they're at so that we can see what what is it that they want to say to you, you know? Let's go ahead. So, Spirit, provide me a mind, body, soul, spirit for the person who is viewing or will be viewing this video, Spirit. Yes, 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 yes. All right. So, temptation. Somebody here is tempted by a lot of different things, and Spirit is saying to be careful. Don't. It's it's okay to check things out, but don't get too close because it might burn you. Financial material changes. So somebody here are going to be experiencing a lot of different changes if they haven't already. You will be having to wait things out with the wedding game card here. It looks like somebody is waiting for some type of results. And in regards to that and result of that, I'm seeing rewards paying off for some. I'm seeing sacrifice. So someone has been sacrificing here a lot for their future, for what they want, for what they're, you know what I'm saying, for what they're dreaming to have, you know what I'm saying? Um, with accelerated motion in reverse, it's not as concerning, but it is It is something that you should look at. Um, things could be at a standstill for you at this time because it looks like something has to play out before it actually comes into fruition. Maybe there's some blockages. Maybe there's some shadow work. Maybe there's some things you have to fill out like paperwork that you have to fill out or things that you have to follow up on in order for you to receive whatever that you have been waiting on, all right? What else, Spirit? Please provide me with more details on the person who's viewing this video. What's going on in their life at this time? Also, please, I do have a, um, before I keep going, I do have a, um, you could call it a, a raffle or a giveaway. Um, if you comment on this video on how this reading resonates for you, you will be entered in my monthly drawing for a free reading at the end of this month. So if you see this video before the 30th or what, the 28th of February, I, I forgot how many days are in this month, you will be selected um, for a free reading. All you have to do is comment on this video, follow Mystic Intellect on Instagram and TikTok. My t new TikTok name is Mystic underscore Intellect. So pay attention to that and please be aware of scammers because they're coming out the woodwork, okay? Pay attention to the spelling of my name and you know how I like to talk to you guys one-on-one -on, -one on Instagram and TikTok. If I am not sending you a video recorded reading 
or a voice memo. It is not me. That's the only way you will know that I my account is legit because I usually send out vo uh, voice memos on Instagram. And if you're booking a reading with me, I only send out video recorded readings. That's it. That's all. I don't do emails. I don't do none of that shit. I will record a video and send it to you because that's how you know it's me. And of course, with my background, it's very unique. It's very, you know what I'm saying? You will know it's me, okay? So, let's get to it. Now, Patience and planning. Somebody is patiently planning something huge, whether it's you waiting for a car to come through, a house, a, um, a bill, you know, something that is supposed to help you elevate in life. Um, I'm seeing someone trying to pay off debt, trying to plan for their future, even trying to start a family with their person. Um, I'm seeing material and spiritual prosperity for many who is watching this video. Spirit is saying that it is time for you to buckle down and get ready for the blessings that are going to be pouring into your life because the universe is operating in your favor at this time. Yes, indeed. The universe is definitely here. Is there it's definitely the universe is here to let you know that they're here um to work in your favor. All right. Temptation spirit is showing me. All right, so the three highlighted cards here from this spread is temptation, material prosperity, and the universe. All right, so that's what will be highlighted here throughout the reading as we tap into your person's energy to see what's going on with them and what message that they have for you. All right, so spirit, what ma uh, what's going on with the person who's viewing this video? What is going on with their person at this time before we tap into what messages that we have for them? This person is going through a lot at this time. So they could be going through some things that they're not telling anybody. Spiritual union is here. So this could be your twin flame or soulmate. They're, they're trying to seek the truth in things. Wow. They're absolutely not. I don't see this person wanting to run away for anyone any much longer. They're actually taking their life seriously. For once in their life. And I hate to say it like this. But for once in their life. They're really wanting to take their life seriously. They're wanting to make different choices. Make certain decisions. And make big moves in their life. So that they can be prepared for a spiritual union with you. Because you know it all starts on the 5D. And then it manifests itself in the 3D. But you can manifest it much sooner. Once you connect with yourself spiritually. And with your person in 5D. To get them to hurry up and come on. You know what I'm saying? Yeah they're trapped in fear at this time. But there is positive movement forward. For this person in this connection with you. They could be. So some of y'all, you guys could have actually broken up. Or, or, or are currently in separation with your person. So with this group that I'm actually tapping into i'm seeing that this will not be for long i'm just seeing a, a huge misunderstanding between the collective who is in separation with their person but those who are not in separation with your person i'm seeing that with some like spirit is saying that time is of the essence all it's taking right now is time and then you just putting energy where you need until the time is right with the base chakra here i'm seeing that there is a lot of upbeat energy here somebody needs to um actually invest in some type of um i hear i'm hearing exercise equipment for some reason i'm also hearing that somebody also needs to do some yoga some meditation some grounding exercises so that they can um stay committed to their goals and their calling i'm just hearing your goals and your calling will literally set you up for success in your relationship it like there is a direct correlation i don't care what nobody else say um with your life path your life purpose and then your your spiritual union with your person your person, like the real, the the original meaning for having a twin flame or a soulmate in this lifetime, is elevating the vibrations of the earth, doing what God has called you to do, and also Him sending, you know, God sending you or the universe sending you somebody or whatever that you believe in, um, sending you somebody to help you elevate the energies of the earth. All right. So, let's go ahead and get started with what messages that they have for you, okay? So, your person, let's go ahead and tap in. Spirit, please give me some insight on what messages this person has for the person who's viewing this video. I don't react when people mention you. This person could be very well... 
very private about their relationship or their connection with you because they don't want somebody fucking it up. Hey, I don't blame them. I left you before you could leave me. So if you are in separate with your person and they left you, they're just saying that because their ego. They just didn't want to feel left out in the cold. Their their ego wouldn't be able to take it if you left them. And a lot of the times when these people, when, when this masculine or feminine energy leaves you for whatever reason, there is before you can even get a word out is because they are, have already premeditated. They manifested it to happen because their insecurities led them to that, to make that decision. A lot of the times when you question yourself, like, well, why did this happen? Why did they leave me? I don't know. Like, well, why? Like, what's going on? They leave you questioning things is because they somehow struggle with their own insecurities and they actually seek try to seek power in the relationship so that they can feel secure again a lot of people don't feel comfortable knowing that you could one day wake up and leave them and so that makes them feel uneasy so that's something that that person needs to work on within themselves they have to work on that because if they don't they will always lead themselves to dead-ended relationships so 1111 just showed up on the clock and that's showing me that, hey, if it's hitting, if it's resonating, let me know. Drop a comment into yourself to win a free reading for me for the month of February. All right. So, yeah, next, the message is I wish things could be different. So this person definitely is reminiscing on the past and where things are at now. And they want things to be different between the two of you. Like they know some things. They know they fucked up on a lot of things and they're wanting to right their wrongs. Yeah, they knew exactly what they was doing. They're saying. I feel you leaving me behind. So these are for this. So now this message is for the collective of divine feminines or masculines who have elevated and upgraded their lives tremendously. You're working on yourself. You're focusing on your bag and you're just trying to just do better, do what, do well in life. But you're also, you're also, I'm seeing you being very generous with your energy and then want, and you're wanting to bring them with you. But it's like, this person could sometimes feel a little left out or even feel a little intimidated by your success. So when you do try to include them on things, it makes them feel kind of like emasculated or make them feel bad. So this could be a masculine energy here that could feel bad whenever you as the divine feminine glow up and upgrade your life and you want, you're wanting to include them. You're asking them, Hey, come in. You know what I'm saying? Come on in, join me on this success, on this journey with me. They don't want to do it because they feel like, you know what I'm saying? Like their insecurities set in. So spirit is saying, you know, Hey, that ain't nothing, none of your concern. Hey, your insecurities ain't got nothing to do with me, boo. Okay. Now, next message that this person, that this other person may have for you, because you, I'm picking up somebody even have two people that they, that they're inquiring about. So, hey, take this message how it resonates. Um, do you, boo? Um, I love you unconditionally. So, somebody has a lot of love for you, honey. And they want to share that with you. They want to let you know that even if you guys are not talking on good terms, you know what I'm saying? Or even if you guys are talking, but y'all been through a lot, they still want you to know, like, hey, I love you unconditionally. All right? Uh, next message. I left when I saw you with somebody. So, um, they're just basically want to let you know. Now, this is somebody else. Now, this is a different energy. So, somebody, I feel like somebody assumed the wrong thing. Or it could have been lurking a little bit too much. You could have been out with your friends and it was a guy there. Or, you know what I'm saying? And they just assumed the worst. Um, another message I'm hearing is that, you know, you probably were cheating. You probably, you know, somebody in this connection was cheating. Somebody. Okay? And they seen it. They saw it happen and they left. Um, but aside from that, I ain't going to spend too much time on that message because it ain't about, it ain't about that. Um, but you were the best thing in my life. Now... This person, this person could also be somebody from your past that you haven't inquiring about. And Spirit is here to let you know that you were the best thing in their life. And they're wanting to let you know that. So, don't be surprised when you have that conversation with them and they actually vocalize these exact words. Um, Last but not least, at the bottom of the deck, we have, I couldn't let you get too close to me because, hey... This person ain't really used to somebody loving on them, giving them a, that that type of attention or care that you you know that you that you give this person. And you know, spirit is wanting you to know that you know, continue being you, continue being courageous, continue being outstanding, continue just operating in that energy that invites people in. You are abundant. You are full of life. You are full of light. So spirit wants you to just continue down that path. Those were the messages. The hidden, um, the hidden 
truth oh sorry the hidden messages from the hidden truth oracle from your person make sure you like this video subscribe follow comment a hey, shoot me a message dm if you need a book or reading if you're inquiring about a reading but just don't know what to choose um but yeah check out my website www.mysticintellect.com for everything that you need all right Oh, it's 15.15. Wow. Okay, cool. So, yeah, thank you so much and have a beautiful night or day. <laughs>